Imagine an electric car battery that has a range of more than 300 miles, charges in about 10 minutes, does not require bulky heating and cooling systems, retains 80% of its charge capacity for 800 cycles, approximately 240,000 miles, and is not prone to spontaneous combustion. Such is the promise of a solid-state car battery, a holy grail that automakers and manufacturers are racing to discover. Toyota announced a $13.6 billion investment in battery technology. They were working on prototypes powered by solid-state batteries. And recently, in an interview with Autoline during the 2022 CES Technology Show, Toyota confirmed that it will begin selling vehicles with solid-state batteries by 2025. So what actually is this solid-state battery that Toyota, an historically conservative automaker, is so serious about? Will it be enough to push Toyota towards top positions in the EV industry? Solid-state and lithium-ion batteries both contain lithium-ions. In both, the lithium-ions move from one part of the battery to another, allowing negatively charged electrons to move through a circuit. The key difference is what the ions move through. In a traditional lithium-ion battery, it's a liquid electrolyte, while a solid-state battery would use a solid material. They're technically more demanding to make, but they could be more efficient than normal lithium batteries. Solid-state batteries have been used in small devices like pacemakers, as well as RFID and wearable devices for years. Having fewer bits and pieces means fewer things can go wrong. In addition, to improve safety, size, and stability, solid-state batteries in EVs would also offer faster charging times, more travel range, and even greater energy density. Solid-state batteries can reach an 80% charge within 15 minutes and incur less strain after multiple charging cycles. A lithium-ion battery will begin to degrade and lose power capacity after 1,000 cycles. On the other hand, a solid-state battery will maintain 90% of its capacity after 5,000 cycles. So think, while a general lithium-ion battery car can support you near 200,000 miles, which is equivalent to 17 years, how much a solid-state battery can support you on the roads? This eventually means the big bet of Toyota in solid-state cars may not go into loss. And according to the European Patent Office and International Energy Agency, Toyota has favorably gotten over 1,000 patents on solid-state batteries to its name. In fact, between 2014 and 2018, Toyota recorded the largest patent applications on solid-state batteries ever. But Toyota is not the only one who invested its all in solid-state batteries. With a lucrative fund from Bill Gates and Volkswagen, an American company named QuantumScape is also working on solid-state batteries for years. But no companies have still managed to bring the solid-state batteries into mass production yet. Luckily, Toyota is teaming up with major battery manufacturers like Panasonic and Toshiba, so they just might have a fighting chance. Now coming to Toyota's solid-state battery cars, Toyota has been working on their electric vehicle lines since 2012 and is determined to change the electric vehicle game with their new solid-state battery cars. According to Toyota, solid-state battery technology is a potential cure-all for the drawbacks facing electric vehicles that run on conventional lithium-ion batteries, including the relatively short distance traveled on a single charge as well as charging times. Also, the solid-state battery cars will charge 0 to 100% in just 10 minutes, with a pretty impressive range of 500 kilometers. That means you can travel up to 500 kilometers by solid-state battery cars in just one charge. It is almost double that a lithium-ion battery can give in one charge and contains minimal risk than a lithium one. The safety of solid-state batteries comes from the replacement of liquid electrolytes with solid materials which makes the battery far less vulnerable to flame and enables them to work in a broader temperature window. For this reason, people in certain tropical climates will have the opportunity to own an electric vehicle. This means less safety technology will be required on the car and more room to give extra power. Even charging the cars won't be a big hassle for you, as the cars will support any public charging point or personal charging counters too. 
Also, it can maintain over 80% of battery charge capacity for 800 charge cycles or 240,000 miles. It means solid-state battery cars will be the ultimate solution of speed, charge, and safety. In the video of Toyota's prototype Solid State, we have seen the car is pretty much similar to Toyota's LQ concept which first debuted in front of the public at the 2019 Tokyo Motor Show. That was not the only time we have seen the LQ. It is the star of Japan and appeared in a series of commercials for the Tokyo Olympic Games. After that, it was seen on the road test of solid-state batteries in August 2020. Yes, that video was uploaded just a few months ago. But Toyota's Vice President of Mobility Communications, Shiro Tachimoto, stated to The Drive that they obtained license plate registration for vehicles equipped with all solid-state batteries and conducted test drives last year. But unfortunately, the breathtaking LQ version is not going to come on mass production. So whoever dreams of riding the LQ on the road will have to wait a bit longer. Instead of the LQ concept, Toyota is going to put the solid-state batteries on their new series of BEVs, the BZ4X. According to Toyota, this series of BZ4X will be on the market by mid-2022. But there is a possibility of getting delayed also. However, according to industry experts, Toyota occupies the top position in solid-state battery technology. And the Japanese government is also trying its best to assist Toyota in the development and research of solid-state batteries. The Japanese government has funded Toyota and Nissan with 2 trillion yen, which is equivalent to $19.2 billion, just to support decarbonization technology. So with conquering the first stage on solid-state batteries and a fund of $19 billion, it won't be too tough for Toyota to bring the electrified cars to life. Though Toyota is at the forefront of the line in solid-state batteries, the competition is not going to be easy for them. Because the Japanese company Nissan is also planning to bring their electric vehicle car based on solid-state batteries by 2028. Mercedes-Benz has also developed the Isitaro bus to run on solid-state batteries. Not to forget BMW, who is also heavily betting on the technology, with a promise to reveal the prototype soon by 2025. Meanwhile, Jaguar, Kia, Audi, Porsche are also dropping their plans for new EV cars. And last but not least, Elon Musk has also revealed their competition for solid-state batteries, the 4680 battery which will be used in future Tesla cars. These are the battery cells that are bigger than Tesla's 2170 batteries and will provide more efficiency in Tesla vehicles. And from Elon's view, the battery will have a jaw-dropping 1 million miles of life. This could mean that we'll see a long-range Model Y built out of the Fremont, California factory and a new high-end performance Model Y built out of Giga, Texas? If all this is true, it'll be interesting to see how solid-state batteries stay in top position. So, it is clearly visible that Toyota's solid-state battery has to face a lot of competition in the future. But as we know, Japan is a country with the most diverse car culture in the world. They tend to share or swap parts from other car manufacturers in order to make cars better. If this culture continues, other car manufacturers will have the freedom to use their innovation without any boundaries and thus improving the automotive industry for all of us.